Welcome back to JSA TV Live, where we are covering the latest stories, trends, and innovations from leaders across the digital infrastructure community. And we're coming to you live from the show floor of Yada in Las Vegas, Nevada. Joining me now, we've got Colin DeLacy with T5 Data Centers. Thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you so much for having me. It's great to be here. Always great to catch up with the folks from T5. There's always a lot to talk about when we when we talk with you. And obviously there's a lot of growing demand in the data center space, which is where you've, you know, that's been your bread and butter for many, many years now. So let's just talk a little bit about some of those demands and how are you addressing it and filling that void? Yeah, absolutely. We're, to address that demand, we're seeing a lot of new entrants in the marketplace. Uh, entrants that have a lot of experience in areas like commercial real estate, uh, like uh, uh, energy, like capital markets, and they really bring a lot of expertise and a lot of assets to bear. And uh, and we complement that quite well. Yeah. So let's let's focus in there for a moment. So how are you bringing value? You know, there's there's that inflection point. You're talking about power. You're talking about land, and and then there's people like you who can come in and really add value and help take it up to the next level. Yeah, absolutely. So the the kind of inflection point that we generally get involved is when those same developers are looking to uh, move from powered shell type development uh, into more of a turnkey uh, type offering. Uh, servicing some of the same clients that we have in the hyperscale community. And um, and so when they turn that corner, um, there's increased returns on those investments, but there's also increased operational risk. And um, that's where we have a lot of experience and a lot of capabilities. Let's talk for a moment about some of those risks and how do you help mitigate that for your clients? Absolutely. So uh, mitigating that risk through the experience that we have. Uh, I mean, we've been uh, developing and operating our own data centers for almost 20 years. Uh, we've been building and operating for our clients at their sites for almost 15 years. So it's that experience, it's the capabilities, it's the track record really that comes into play. And uh, and while these teams, they hire the best in the business. You know, they hire folks from the hyperscale community, they hire folks from very mature service providers, uh, but it's building out those teams in order to have the institutional type of support that uh, that really is our bread and butter. Yeah. Let's talk about the hyperscalers for a moment. You're you're working with a, a lot of them. Of course, we're not going to name any names, but that's a, a, a place that you've been servicing very well for many years. What are you noticing in terms of how their needs are evolving here in the last few years? Well, their, their needs are always unique and, and they are always evolving. So um, sometimes they're moving towards outsourcing. Sometimes they're moving more towards insourcing. But there's always key components that are in play that uh, T5 can help to, to support. And so um, we support in a variety of ways, uh, anywhere from training to um, to uh, contracting to support mechanical and electrical to full operations and, and anywhere in between. You know, we meet our clients where they want to be met for how long they want us to be there for. And uh, and that's our business. Yeah, that's so huge. Are there things that you're keeping your eye on as you are attending conferences like Yada where we're hearing a lot about, you know, high performance computing and AI and whatever is coming next? Are there things that you're particularly watching? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, AI comes with, you know, direct liquid cooling. I mean, you got to be able to support the, the new technologies that really are based on tried and true uh, uh, type of methods, but there's nuances to them. Um, we support uh, uh, CDUs and, and direct liquid to chip in about 20% of our data centers. So we have considerable experience, uh, everything from designing to deploying to managing to the chemistry that's involved. There's there's nuances uh, that are based on, on the way that things have been run for a long time. So. Okay. Well, before we let you go, is there anything coming up that you would like to give us a sneak peek of or just kind of generally what's next for T5? You know, in addition to the areas that I talked about, really, you know, our bread and butter is the fact that, you know, we develop, we construct and we operate and we can be a force multiplier across those different areas. And it's not just that, it's um, the, the handoffs that are between construction and operations. It's the, the number one risk that many hyperscalers identify is, is that handoff. And being owners ourselves, we can see around corners, we can see the big picture, we can help from that point of view. Uh, but it's really, you know, use us where you want to use us. And, um, you know, we, we appreciate being part of this growing growing industry and, and uh, appreciate you having me here today. Yeah, well, thank you. It's always great to talk to you and to catch up with the folks from T5. So thank you for stopping by. Absolutely. Be All well. Right.
And to our viewers, thank you for tuning in. Stick around. We've got much more to come live from the show floor of Yada. In the meantime, everyone, happy networking. Thank you.